Hey there, crazy kids. I am the good old gamer. I'm back to love and more Minecraft. Yay! It's been a while, I know. The game's been updated, so I had to uh, update my game to 1.4.5. And that means I had to reinstall all the mods and stuff. Now, I have most of the same mods that I had before. I have the Death Chest mod, I have Optifine, which... Aha! Uh -huh. Achievement for taking inventory because all my inventory got reset and stuff. Um, all the achievements and whatever. Uh, let's see. I do have Optifine, I'm pretty sure. Let's see. Uh, here. There we go. Bunch of Optifine settings and stuff that I haven't really bothered with. I just assume that the default of whatever the the settings is for Optifine is good enough. Um, yeah, good enough. And this one here, this is a new option from one of the new mods that I have. Um, it's called Enchant View. That was pointless, but whatever. Um, so Enchant View is this neat little mod that uh, when you uh, use the enchanting tables, if you uh, let the mouse hover over the different enchantments on the side, um, a tooltip will pop up and it'll tell you what the enchantments are. So like here where it says coal and stuff, you know, or the same sort of thing will come up when the enchantment list and I'll tell you exactly which enchantments are on there so that when you pick them you're not just getting some random crap and, you know, spending 30 levels on, you know, what is it, unbreaking 2 or something, you know, something stupid, you know, so you'll get some decent enchantments, so I think that's pretty cool. As far as I know, it just tells you what the enchantments are. It doesn't modify them or anything in any way. Um, so that's a new mod I have. I have the Death Chest mod. I have Inventory Tweaks again, which you can kind of see through this thing. Um, basically, I only have Inventory Tweaks to uh, get like items down in the uh, in the quick bar when the items break. Like when this pickaxe breaks, this new one will come up right automatically right in the same spot. Um, the only mods I couldn't get updated were the griefing mods when it comes to... Um, oh, there's a bat. That's cool. When it comes to uh, the creepers and the ghasts and the endermen. They're all normal now. Uh, when, they, when creepers explode or when gas cause explosions, they do regular damage to the world and endermen act like endermen, they can pick up blocks and all that crap. I used to have mods that took care of that, so creepers would uh, cause damage to players and mobs, but not damage blocks in the world, and endermen couldn't take blocks, and gas couldn't damage blocks either, but um, those mods haven't updated, and I haven't been able to find replacements, so we'll just have to deal with it for now. Alright, so with all that fun explanation, um, this is the first time I've played Minecraft in a while, especially, certainly since it's updated, so I don't really know all the new updates. Um, I have kind of an idea of most of them, like the witches and the bats and uh, the mobs using different weapons and armors and stuff. And I get kind of the gist, but I haven't played any of it yet, so I haven't experienced any of it yet, so this will be interesting. Um, of course, there are new sounds and stuff, too. Uh, the reason I'm still here in the cave is we still need to get a few more diamonds in order to get a pick and an enchanting table. I believe we only have one diamond as of right now. Um, and we need four more, three for a pick, and two for, uh, three for a pick, and two, 
two for an enchanting table. Oh, come on. Oh, there's some new sounds I have to get used to because I haven't played with them before. And I'm not going to lie, the bats are kind of freaking me out a little bit. Not that they can actually do anything as of yet, but... They still kind of get to me. So those of you new to the series, I don't know why you haven't been watching from the start, but... The mods I have are just convenience mods. They don't add any content to the game. They just basically enhance content that's already in the game, like the inventory management and the death chest and that sort of thing. There's no new items, no new blocks, nothing like that. The main reason I am doing that, of course, is for times like this when the game updates if I don't get the mods updated on time or I want to keep recording the series even immediately after the game updates and I can't have the mods, I can still play the world because there's no extra content. I'll just be playing without whatever the mod enhancements are for a while. And most of the mod enhancements aren't all that big of a deal. They're mostly convenience mods. Lava, you need to go faster. <laughs> Ooh, redstone. Well, we're getting down to the good levels anyway. The enchantment view mod thing is going to be nice. Um, being able to know what enchantments I'm getting so I can pick and choose a little better. That's always good. Now, some of you might be thinking, well, that takes the fun, supposedly, out of the randomness of enchanting, and I can see that point to a certain extent, but it does take quite a while to get to level 30, um, and that's even if you bother with, um, like, mob traps and stuff, let alone doing it just with, you know, naturally takes even longer that way. Um, so it'll be nice to know exactly what I'm getting. Um, also, I'm not an expert at the enchanting stuff, so I kind of have an idea of certain enchantments I want to get, but like, I'm not going to be sitting there for an hour <laughs> at the enchantment table just trying to get the... Um, exact enchantments I want or whatever. I, it's it's just to make sure I get decent levels for my experience. Like, if I spend 10 levels on an enchantment, I don't want a level 1 enchantment, unless there's, you know, a couple level 1 enchantments. You know, I don't want to waste 10 levels on an enchantment I could get for 5, you know. Yeah, you go. You go and die. I kind of would have wanted the skeleton's uh, loot, but he was by lava, so I figured I probably wasn't going to get it. And I really don't know why I'm getting this redstone. I, I don't use it enough to really bother, but it's here, so I might as well, right? I guess I can use it for minecart tracks and stuff anyways, at the very least. I do want to have some automatic farms for harvesting using pistons and stuff, but 
I probably have more than enough redstone for that sort of thing already. Obviously, I pro obviously I don't need coal at this point, but I'm an alpha player. I want to get coal when I can get it. Sorry, it's been so long since I've put up videos. I know some of my more loyal viewers out there are probably wondering if I've died, because it's been quite a while. But, um, I've been busy with stuff in life, and I work in retail, as many of you guys know, and it's getting to be the big holiday shopping season, so that's keeping me busy. And I have other things going on, so YouTube is kind of taking a back seat a bit. Not that I don't love you guys and don't want to provide for you guys, but uh, I don't get paid for this, and when life gets in the way, life takes priority. And that was inventory tweaks. After my pickaxe broke, it brought me my new one that I had available in inventory, so that's why I have it for convenience. Now we're not getting any more diamond, unfortunately, but we are getting some other good stuff, so we'll make do, I guess. I kind of like to follow the lava trails a bit. Sometimes they're a good indicator of diamonds. What level are we on? Let's see. Uh, Eleven. So yeah, we're we're pretty pretty good on the diamond level. I think it's twelve or something. That's the optimum level for the diamonds. Although we're not finding any here. That kind of sucks. But we are finding other good stuff like coal and iron and redstone, so we're making do, I guess. How are you guys liking the new updates? You like the new sounds and the witch and the um, bats and the um, what else? Oh, the anvil and stuff. That's in the game now. So you can name your things, your tools and swords and stuff. That might actually be pretty cool to check out. I know the anvil is mainly used for uh, enchantments, putting different item enchantments together in the same item, but um, I think it'd be kind of neat to have it to personalize your tools and stuff. Kind of cool. does take quite a bit of armor or I armor iron to make them but uh, shouldn't be too much of a problem we have quite a bit of iron on us might have to make one of those when we get back up to the surface I wish you could do something with the bats tame them or at least get some sort of I don't I don't even think they have any mob loot on them. I think killing them only gets you a little bit of experience if if, if that, I don't know. I imagine you get experience, you get experience for farm animals and stuff too. Give me a diamonds game. Diamonds. I mean, lapis is good, I guess, but diamonds. Why am I even getting the lapis? Because I can have some blue uh, um, not iron, leather armor when I get home. That'll be cool. My favorite color is blue. Not that that really matters, but, you know. 
All right, not getting anything here. You'd think I'd be able to find four more diamonds. That's all I need, four. I really would get out of this cave if I could find four more diamonds. That's all I want. I hear a slime. So I guess most of the mobs have sounds now. I think even the squid have sounds but I haven't heard them. That'd be kinda cool, I guess. Easy way to block off the lava there! <laughs> I love that. I know some of you are fans of lava, but I am so not. I mean, I guess it has its uses, but yeah, I can I can do without it for the most part. Anyway, I don't really want to be going up, I want to be going down. Yep, and then we're playing on hard, so... I don't even know why I checked. I was going to check and make sure mobs are on, but we already fought a skeleton, so... Of course mobs are on. Wow, I'm stupid. There was gold over here somewhere. Or did I get it already? Maybe I got it already. Nope, it's alright here. New sounds for walking on gravel, I guess. Getting lots of good stuff. Too bad it's not diamonds! Well, this cave's pretty good size anyway. Oh no, I hear a spider. Should probably be getting to end in the video here pretty soon. Get a few more of this mining here. It's coal. I'll go ahead and end the video for you guys. Feeling in the mood to record some more, so I'll probably just make another video from here. Try to get done on this one. And I do have time to make another video, so that's good. What the hell is that? Let's just be lighting glitches, I imagine. Whatever, I'll figure that out later. I'm going to go back here and get some iron that I missed that I'm sure some of you were yelling at me to get. Yay!
All right. Next time, we will continue to explore this wonderful cave and continue our search for the elusive four diamonds we need. That's all I need is four. Anyways, thanks for watching, boys and girls. I am the good old gamer, and this has been more love and Minecraft. Bye bye for now.